Hi guys, welcome back to another video. In this one today, we're going to be showing you how to get the new wonder weapon in the DLC map Firebase Z for Cold War Zombies. Okay, for the first step, you want to make your way to the data center area, which is the room under the giant satellite. Um, in this one, I activated the ether reactor because it will open a door down the bottom here. It requires power. Once you run out through the power door, you can open the big double doors there and in on your left hand side on the wall, you'll see the blueprint. If you collect that one, you'll be ready to go for the next step. Okay, for the next step of this easter egg, you want to make your way out through the barracks area out to the scorched defense at the back here. Uh, you want to make your way over the sandbags down to the tank. You'll find a person there. His name is Dimitri. You need to collect his eye. Naturally, I'm not going to show it on YouTube because it is a bit raw for YouTube, I suppose. Uh, but yeah, you take his eye and you want to go back to the weapons lab room. So that's back through the data center, down to the lower level and in through the double doors we opened in the previous step. And on the desk next to the computer, you'll see a little retinal scanner. You want to interact with it. You'll place the eye in. It'll scan to prove that you are in fact him and open up a drawer which you can collect a locker key. We need this for the next step. Once you have the locker key collected, you want to make your way back into the barracks area and next to each set of beds, you'll see the lockers you can use to open. So use the key, open up the lockers, and as you go through, there will be one, maybe two of them that will spawn a mimic. What you want to do is fight the Mimic, take it down, and if you're lucky, it should drop a part you need for the Ray Rifle. So you see, I got mine there, couldn't quite pick it up before I got attacked again, so I'll take down this Mimic, and when I go back, you'll see the barrel on the floor, you collect that part, you're ready for the next step. Okay, for the next step, you do need to pass a few rounds, as you need to be able to spawn in a Mangler, and they generally don't spawn until around 15. When one does spawn in, you want to fight it, uh, obviously take it down like you do any other enemy. I believe shooting it in the cannon is a weak spot for it. And if you're fortunate enough, it will drop a what appears to be a magazine you can collect. So you'll see in this game I wasn't fighting, but my mate was. And you'll see in the top right corner, it'll pop up in just a moment to say that, I've actually, that we've in fact picked it up like that. And once you do collect the, the clip, you'll need to take it back over to the weapons lab room. So you see I'm running through here now. And there will be a little charging dock on the bench. So I don't put it in here, but I like melee it so my friend can see. He interacts with it and we'll put it into the charges. You need to leave that for a whole two rounds. You'll know you've done it correctly when it's glowing purple like so. So in our game, we did it on round 15. So you leave it for all of 16 to charge and you can recollect on round 17. So you can just go back in, re-interact with the charging dock on the bench and you should pick the clip up straight away. Okay, for this final step, you want to interact with the computer on the desk, and you'll see there'll be a little section that will start moving around. It will stop on certain spots, and then restart moving in the other direction. Now, it will do this three times. It will stop, and these correspond to a particular section on a dartboard. So, um, you work out roughly where they stop at, work out what numbers you need, and out in the village, next to the Wonder Fizz machine, you'll find a dartboard. You shoot all three numbers, in order and then hit the bullseye, the dartboard will open up and drop the last part for you to collect. Okay, so once you've collected all of these parts, you can go back into the weapons lab, onto the bench that was in front of the blueprint from the first step, and you can build the Ray K84 on that bench. So you see, I've just built it in our video here. I am waiting on my, my friend to come over so he can collect this pack a punched rifle that I have, or SMG, sorry. So once it gets over here, you run back over to your bench, you can pick up the Ray K off there, and you've got yourself a free wonder weapon. Now this is quite very powerful, especially in the later waves when it's pack-a-punched, does fantastic damage against the boss, and is required for one of the steps of the Easter egg. So definitely worthwhile spending a bit of time to get this done. But that's all for today, guys. It's the end of the video. We'll see you guys in the next one.